Who was spoiled? I hate this. It's supposed to be like this, but the splits. Ooh, hate that the splits are too high. I'm being scared is holding you back. <laughs> How about Jesus? You yeah. look crazy. <laughs> Oh, I hate when this happens. Anyway, um, being scared is holding you back. I'm going to just pick at this. Oh, God. Somebody was trying to use you as a test dummy high up, and they're pure evil. I just seen that. Wow. And you know it. Yeah, somebody's trying to use you to their own advantage. They're trying to see how far they can go with they're using you as a test dummy and they want you to be their slave in their bread crumbing you. Somebody high up. Being scared is holding you back because whoever you are, you know exactly who it is, okay? Singling you out will be their exposure. So they're singling you out. It's time to have that talk. Everything you lost, you will get back ten times. So they didn't already made you have to take losses. Why why are you so obsessed with me? Like what the fuck? Playing victim, so they're they're blaming you for something that happened within the, in their life, and it's like, how are you gonna blame me? And I live this lifestyle, and you somebody that's high up. Let me know what I is, so I can act accordingly, right? And some of you guys are like, how the hell? Like you just so confused on how how you regular Joe, regular Joanne, could even affect this person high up the way that they're acting like. They're active. I don't know, but anyway. The people who once supported their nonsense is now about to turn away. They about to turn away because they realize it's nonsense. So they even had a campaign of people. Wow. We got true love. They had a campaign of people coming after you and fucking with you, harassing you. Your enemies are about to watch you celebrate. Whoa, what's wrong with somebody? <laughs> All right, so you have somebody higher blaming you for some, their problems or a loss they didn't take or something. What's really going on? They didn't realize you was God child. And no matter how much money they have, how much status they have, they can't control you. It was people that could have helped you, but they did it. They chose not to. Continue to stay loyal and down for the greater cause, okay? Whoever you are, you a soldier. Trying to force it just might break it or damage it. They for sure were trying to get you fired, put out, or lose it all. Money will improve. You can't be seen with them. So, it's up from here. Don't worry about shit, whoever I'm talking to. You may have been trying to force a situation, trying to force yourself to understand it, trying to force it to be right, to go right, but it don't even matter. Somebody's a fucking fool. All right, they didn't understand you. They didn't understand what you was about, and they was blaming you for why things were going wrong in their life when you had nothing to do with their fucking life and their decisions. They just took it upon themselves to fucking get blinded by somebody's like blinded by you. They're is this going back to the person that's in love with you? Because I did say true love. What is this? Okay, I seen that. Somebody took it upon themselves to make you their host, right? Make you their host. They were going to leech off of you and blame you for everything. What's the word? I'm, I'm not getting the word that I'm trying to fucking, how can I say it? But this is a parasite. Anyway, that ain't what I was trying to say, though. But what's really going on? What's really going on? It's clear as day. Somebody's unhealed. They need to heal. This could even be a Sagittarius doing this to you. But somebody is off balance. Somebody does things out of moderation. Okay? Somebody does not know how to take their time. They are not patient. They're very impatient. Somebody is a devil. And it's a lot of public recognition and fame and success when it comes to this situation. Someone could even be publicly known or it's publicly known that somebody is losing all hope and all faith. Okay, 
they're losing hope that the situation will regain itself, re, re, rebalance itself, get re back, restore. This. Is somebody, what's going on? Dealing with healing and restoring themselves. Somebody needs to heal, but they're having a hard time healing. They're having a hard time seeing the brighter picture, the brighter side of things. They're having a hard time. They're losing all hope and all faith. There's something that's very, very much off balance. Why can I speak now? Cherry in reverse. Somebody will not have a victory and success over what it is that they've been doing to you. My feet are so fucking... Anyway. <laughs> I've been walking around barefoot. I need to mop again. It's not black, but it's like... Anyway. Uh, somebody is a little lost losing direction, scattered all over the place, and they want you to be the same way too. You may even be realizing their energy is rubbing off on you, okay, and that's the truth. The truth is this person is jealous of you, and they are obsessively stalking you and trying to come up with some type of plan to stop you from going through some type of rebirth or transformation or ending the situation fully, putting an end to something. Could be a, a Sagittarius, a Scorpio. It was an Aquarius. What's really going on? Could be a Libra in here. Somebody's not protected over the illegal and justified that shit that they've been doing to you. What's really going on? The moon could be a Pisces in here, okay? But there is for sure some secrets. You about to get some good news. Somebody for sure has been obsessively stalking and watching you, trying to come up with some plans that are not good. They could even have been gossiping about you. There's been a lot of chit-chat behind your back. It ain't been good. And a lot, a lot of spying. A lot of spying, a lot of watching. It's a lot of secrets, okay? Somebody's hiding a lot from you. What's really going on with this person in their subconscious? Something's going on up in their brain, too. They thinking about some crazy shit. Page of Pentacles in reverse. Page of, page of Pentacles in reverse and Ace of Pentacles in reverse. So this person is holding back from giving you some type of opportunity or they, they're trying to hold you back because they don't want you to go off and start this new opportunity or get this opportunity or go and learn this new adventure that's going to turn into a big opportunity. Okay, you may be trying to venture off and be an entrepreneur. You may be going to school to get some type of license or certificate or something. They don't want you doing that because they know it's going to pop off for you. Whoever you are, you have detached from somebody that was very, very toxic. Are you detached from something that you was doing that was toxic? Are you, you detached from just wanting to live like the Joneses, the shit when you're dealing with like the money, power, and the fame? Like you really don't care about all that grand, big shit, okay? You don't really care about that show-off shit. And now this person is ashamed and regret because they know they didn't did something behind closed doors and they're going to have to let go of you or let go of it or it's going to have to get released or come out about what they didn't did. It's something dealing with... It's a lot of secrets going on. Uh, at one point in time, you was big on, like, image, clout, brands, name brands, money, power, fame, success, recognition, being seen, and you don't really care about that shit no more. But some of you guys, it's not even that. You could have been overindulging. You may have had some type of codependencies to a substance, some type of substance, whatever that substance was, and now you don't. So they're not able to keep up with what it is that they've been doing to you. I said this one of my readings already today. Somebody was doing spell work to, for, on you, and it was only working because you was indulging in some type of, like, you was either always drunk. I don't really think it's drunk, though, even though they do call liquor spirits. I think it was more so like a, a drug, a heavy sedative drug that had you crossing over. Okay? Now, that's only for some of y'all. It was, it was a little more than weed. If it's not that, you was just used to the, the fast life. You was addicted and you was used to the fast life and you, you wanted the fast life, but you don't now. You don't really care about that shit no more. You don't really care about being the spotlight. It's somehow, some way, they was getting over on you because of that. It was something. I don't know what was going on. What's going on, spirit? What's going on, spirit?
So, you feel left out on the cold or they feel left out on the cold. Someone could even be going broke. Someone's having a hard time taking care of themselves, love on themselves. Whoever you are, you might even detach from this person. You're no longer feeding into this person. You're no longer nourishing this person. You have get a disconnect. You have disconnected completely from this person, um, and it's an ending, a complete ending. You yourself could be going through a rebirth because you're feeling empty inside. You feel like you're losing your spark, your creativity. You don't have nothing left of you, so you know you have to go through a rebirth. You may even feel like this person took everything from you. They took their your energy, your essence. Then I write it could be Libra Taurus, Scorpio in here. There's for sure gonna be a breakup. What's really going on with this Five of Pentacles, the Empress in Reverse, and Death? Somebody could even be ghosting somebody, but somebody don't, they refusing to walk away. But somebody knows it's time to end the situation again, because they're not saying they're trying to stop you from ending the situation. It's done because you are, you're not able to take care of yourself like you want to. Being in this situation, it's like, it's something off about the situation where you know it's something going on and it, you just, it don't sit right with you. You're not able to be creative like you once was at one point in time. You're not able to manifest how you once was or did at one point in time. What's really going on? The sun in reverse. You could even be depressed. You stress the fuck out. You're doing this on your own. There's a lot of stalking going on. Somebody's ready to take action. They want to come to some type of resolution. They know that they've been playing games with you. Wow, they love you. So somebody is playing games. What the fuck is going on? Somebody's scared to tell you that they want to be with you? That they love you to the point where it got you feeling crazy? Because I don't know what the fuck y'all doing in these streets, y'all. Y'all got me feeling crazy now. What's really going on? I might like stalking the fuck out of you though. Somebody could be big on clout. Like somebody else is really big on clout. So they they could be doing so much shit trying to get um It's 82 in here, no wonder. I'm like, it's kinda hot. I'm sorry, I'm looking at the temperature. What what temperature is it gonna be when it gets hot, hot? I'm so scared right now. Anyway, um, somebody could be trying to get the approval, that's what I'm trying to say, the approval of, like, the public and other people when it comes to you, to the point that they're doing a lot of things. They could even be, like, exploiting you, stalking you, exploiting you, like, saying shit in jokish ways, but it's serious because they're they scared of how people, they're, like, really nitpicking and judging everything that you do. Maybe they hold some type of image where they have to be perfect, but like somebody is expecting you to be perfect. You're, not, I don't know what the fuck this is. Cause they in love with you, but they don't really want people to know, or they like they're insecure. I don't, it's something with their image. I think I did a reading like this already. It's something with their image. I think I need to sit down and go over my readings now. I'm going to do a few more until I feel like I, I don't want to do no more, though. I can go all night with the readings. <laughs> the fuck? Anyway, there's some unfinished business. Okay, so although you feel like I'm done, I'm tired, I'm giving this up, the cycle just has not wrapped up completely. There is still some type of unfinished business. The cycle has not came to a full closure at all. So you done, but they not done. Are they not done, but you done. Somebody done, somebody not done. What's this nine of wands in reverse and the world in reverse? It's so many, it's been so much contradicting energy like this. And then we got death in reverse and seven of swords. So again, somebody is not done. Somebody is refusing this transformation or this ending. Somebody is like, no, you being sneaky. Somebody is being sneaky and deceptive trying to figure out how they're going to get away with this. Stopping this ending from, they want this relationship with you. They want this partnership with you. I keep talking about lately, somebody is not taking no for an answer. 
They're not. It surely could be a Scorpio, a Leo, Sagittarius, Aquarius, Pisces. Who else was in here? Libra Taurus. All right. Somebody want a relationship with you, and it could be because they going fucking broke. King of Pentacles in reverse. They Business is kind of fucked up for them right now. They don't know how to manage money. They may not know how to manage money on their own either. They may need you to help them manage money. Oh, goodness gracious. So this person is being sneaky and deceptive. They for sure are refusing the transformation or an ending. Be mindful too because this person could be running away from their responsibilities trying to come to you. Okay? That could be what the Seven of Swords is too because they're not able to take all of what they got. They only can take some and leave the rest. So be mindful that this person is trying to run away from their responsibilities and come to you with some problems and some shit. They holding on to the Five of Swords in their hand. That ain't good. Anyway, what is this? My nose just started to hit the nose. Nose. They're trying to bring you some bullshit. High Priestess. It's something hidden. But then we got Six of Wands. So publicly it's being shown that somebody is not so loving, not so caring. They're not pregnant. They're not able to manifest something. Um, they're not feeling the love. Somebody's not a, not taking care of themselves the right way, not nourishing themselves. It's something dealing with self love. Somebody's lacking like self love and nourishment, or somebody has completely disconnect from a connection. Okay, high priestess. Somebody has completely disconnected. They exhausted again. Nine of Wands in reverse. Exhausted. Done. Tired. Use your intuition. Somebody is childish. Pay attention to your intuition. Pay attention to your dreams. Somebody's not getting their wish for fulfillment at all. And because of that, it's going to be so fast. Somebody's going to try to come in and stop you. Because you're not happy at all. Five of Swords and you, Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Cups. Then I tell you with these games and these illusions. Then I say they're coming to you with the Five of Swords. It's somebody else in the background. It's two people on in here. Somebody is trying to come to you with this Five of Swords energy, child. Y'all not listening to me. Y'all don't be listening to me. Okay. Three of Cups. It's another person in here as well, too. They want you for the money, power, and the fame. It's a lot of, it's a lot of publicity. Like, I said somebody could have, like, a, it's dealing with an image or some shit of that nature. This could even be somebody in the public eye. For some of you guys, they may not even be satisfied with their person. I don't motherfucking know. So just be mindful. There might even be some drama, some chaos, some chit-chat, because this person may be hopping from one person to you. Okay? Leave, ooh, leaving. Did I? Did I? Leaving a person to come to you. I want you, but I don't have my life in order. Then I say they they don't know they don't have their life in order. It's not all the way straight, but they're looking at you to help them get it in order. I don't know what this is. I'm gonna just pull three and fucking scared of the consequences, so they're throwing the blame on you or others. Seven of Pentacles. I'm like seven the story. They're trying to run away from something. They're trying to run away from something. They're trying to bring their problems to you. They're trying to bring you that five of swords energy. I don't know what the fuck it is that they didn't did. Oh, in the very beginning. Then I say, I forgot what the fuck I said. And I be talking about because I just be going with the flow. I said, somebody is trying to, I said this. I said, somebody is trying is blaming you for some losses or some endings or something. They're trying to blame you for why something is not going right in their motherfucking life. That's what I said. This person that is um that got high power or a high status or something, they're trying to blame you for their losses. For the they say you bringing them blockages and disturbances, but how? Public fucking attention, bro. You cannot make this shit up. Why y'all be playing with me, bro? Why y'all be playing with me? Living a rich undercover life. What the fuck? We gonna leave that at that. They think you know their secrets. And what's hidden? High Priestess. The Moon. High Priest. Somebody being sneaky and deceptive. They think you out here causing issues. And it's they self conscious. That's the Moon. It's they self conscious fucking with them. Because they know they hiding some shit. That's a guilty conscience. They know they hiding something. And they know you, High Priestess, you got good intuition. You know. That's really what it is. 
I'm out here living the rich undercover life. I'm gonna pull through three miles. Damn, it gave me three. I wanted to get three from each fucking deck. Try yoga, exercise, police activity. Now that you know, start playing their game. I'm going to get something solid. I just want one from each side. Making false reports about you. That's what this person was doing. Because I want to see you guys together. Today's your lucky day. Okay, well... So, some of you guys, it's this person's ex, somebody's ex, too. They may even know that this person is coming to you. You know how that be. Sometimes we be knowing because we be watching. Like I said, one of my baby daddies, I, I seen he was dealing with so many females, and a couple of them became baby mama later on down the line. And I been seeing it happen to watch, and I was going through the phone, seeing this person deal with this person. When he wasn't coming home, he was at this person's house and blah, they, blah, they. And they end up having babies together. A couple of them. So, I know how it is, especially when you know for a fact that this person probably going to end up being with this person. So, uh, yeah. So, just know that this person is watching and they know that this person want to come to you. Alright, I love you guys so much. Take care. So, this could even be their person. They both could be like in the public eye. And they could be, their person could be blaming you for the fact that uh, this person is leaving them. Yeah. All right, use your intuition. Whoever you are, you entanglement and de independent. You independent, so it's kind of like, uh, God has the last say so. Living a secret, rich, double life again. Undercover life. Dip, 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 uh, hey, Dale Hill, God's wrath. Sagittarius, pack your bags. Everything you lost, you'll get back ten times. Yeah, judge you based off of their insecurities. Take your time. Don't rush this process. Break, breaking the silence. Somebody ready to break the silence? Use your intuition. Try a different approach. Your parents or guardians can't stand you. Forgive. You got some hidden helpers in traffic trying to help you. Somebody's a pedo. Try a different approach. Okay, y'all wowing right now. All right, look into a skill or a trade. You might need to get a job to get this project or new baby that you want. Somebody sits up and reports all your content as well, too. So, anyway, I love y'all so much. Take care.